here's how to loose lace Nike Air Jordan 1s. Start by taking your lace and what we're going to do is we're going to feed each lace end down into the two very bottom eyelets from above. So let's go down to this one first. Pull it through only a little bit, not all the way. Swap to the other lace end and we're going to take it down into this eyelet on this side from above just like this. Pull it through a little bit like that. Then what we're going to do is grab a hold of the lace ends together like that and we're going to pull the rest of the lace all the way through. Keeping a hold of them like this means that your laces will come out of equal length and you won't have to mess around getting them both to be the same but if you do don't worry about it, pause the video, take as much time as you need, there's literally no rush. Then we're going to keep a hold of this lace and we're going to go over the sneaker tongue and down into the next eyelet up on this side. So down into that one from above, pull it through. And you can play the video on half speed if you need, just take as much time and follow along. Then we're gonna to swap to the other lace and we're gonna do the same on the other side, down into the next empty eyelet from above. And pull it all the way through. Looking good. And you just wanna make sure there's no twists or creases in any of your laces. Then we're gonna keep a hold of this one Take it over the sneaker tongue and down into the next available eyelet. Then swap back to the other one and down into the next available eyelet on the other side. Now the key is to make sure you're following exactly what I'm doing and your laces are all sitting in the exact same pattern if that makes sense. So this lace should always be on top each time. Keep a hold of this one over the sneaker tongue, down into the next empty eyelet from above and pull it through. Looking good. Swap back to the other one and do the exact same on the other side. Down into it from above. Great. Keep a hold of this lace over the sneaker tongue and down into the next available eyelet. Pull it all the way through. Making sure you don't get any twists, so it definitely happens. Then swap back to the other one, down to the next available eyelet again. Awesome, keep a hold of this one. And bring it over the sneaker tongue and down into the next eyelet. Getting the hang of it now. <laughs> Swap back to the other one. Do the exact same on the other side. Bring it down into the next eyelet available. Now at this point, what I like to do is just take a second to adjust my laces and make sure they're all sitting kind of nice. And the pattern's looking cool. Then we're gonna go in again with this one. And you should be at the second eyelet down from the top. If not, if you have more or less eyelets than me, when you reach the one that's second down from the top, go into it from above for the last time. Same on the other side. Down into the second one down from the top, from above for the last time. And here's where the cool loose lacing little trick comes in. So for the very final eyelets on either side, we're gonna go up into them from underneath, if that makes sense. So keep a hold of this lace. We're gonna go into the eyelet from underneath and we're only going to pull it out around about this much don't worry about this swap to the other one and do the exact same on the other side bring it up into that final eyelet from underneath and pull out about this much so it's even on either side now with all these excess laces what you can do is literally just tuck them behind the sneaker tongue like this out of sight and they'll just sit on top of your foot and they won't bother your foot at all, they're really soft. And it'll finish everything off with a really nice, crisp, clean look. Repeat on your other sneaker and you'll have a really awesome pair of loose lace Nike Air Jordan 1s. If you found the info in this video helpful, please hit the like button for me to help it reach more people and consider subscribing for more lacing content. I have loads of videos available to inspire you guys. Thanks a lot.